Hello. Hello. Hope you're all alright and doing well drawing these unprecedented times. So today we're going for just a local walk. It's our one form of exercise a day that we're doing, obviously because of what's been going on at the minute. Yeah, we'll be going into our local woods as the bluebells are up, so we thought it'd be nice to capture them. And if we come across anybody, we'll be observing the uh, social distancing rules. Yeah. So, let's go. One of the great things about our local woods is it's got an um, exotic species of tree and in front of me you can see we have two in these woods, a California redwood tree. And just in the background there is the second California redwood tree. Further of a trent over there is the beast and weir. And also I just thought I'd mention that these woods have ancient wood status. And here we have another mass area of the lovely blue bounds. Right, so we've just come out of the end of the woods, we're going to head downhill and we're going to go past Home Pit Pond um, and then we're going to head off home. Uh, luckily we haven't come across anybody yet, so fingers crossed. So now we're at the bottom of the grove. As you can hear, the birds are in full song. There's not a soul around. It's quite warm. Yeah, it's turned out to be a really beautiful day. Great form of exercise.
So we're now on the lower level and we were originally at the cliff top in the woods which is just literally at the top of this hill. So here we have the home pit pond. You can see the natural layers in the cliff face. Not 100% from a bit of research, I saw something about it being gypsum, satin spa, sort of selenite. And here is a much larger section. The geology. Face. And this is quite new since the last time I was here. It looks like there's been a sort of landslide on this section. This cliff face is called Witcher's Steps, so the steps. I used to play on this as a kid. Good climb. This part of the ornamental gardens belongs to Clifton Hall, which is just, just above over there. Right, so there you can see Beast and Weir, and here we have the River Trent. This is another place we used to play on, it's called Devil's Drop. It's changed a lot over the years. This here is the old ice house which belonged to Clifton Hall. So this is the very top of the grove now and apparently it was this piece of land that inspired J.M. Barry's Peter Pan. Here we have St Mary's Church. And here we have Clifton Hall. Right, so we've now finished our one form of daily exercise. Uh, luckily for us we didn't really see anybody but we would have observed the social distancing rules had we come across anybody. Uh, and just 
for the record, the reason that we're actually together is because we are part of the same household as we're civil partnered. But it's nice to get out and have some fresh air, so we are quite lucky for this one form of exercise. I mean, ideally, I'd like to go out a lot more, but so you've got to be sensible with what's going on at the minute. Yeah. Um, and on that note, I hope you're all safe um, and keeping well. And um, hopefully, you know, when this is all over, we can resume our, uh, our normal travelling regime. Yeah, so just stay safe, observe the rules, and hopefully we can get through this as quick as possible. Yeah, definitely. Thanks, guys. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you. Bye.